Everything in our world interacts with its surroundings. Like raindrops on the window dancing like drunken blobs, we are exploring some amazing interactions between mass and space. Frame dragging. Frame dragging gives us a glimpse into the elasticity and pliability of space. From the extreme expanse of the universe to galaxies and planets, mass dictates the shape of space and space dictates where mass will go. We will explore some of the measured effects of this and discuss what the possible causes could be. Just as mass distorts space causing gravity, it would seem that mass moving through space causes additional warping, twisting and bending. Gravity Pro B measured this using highly sensitive gyroscopes and has confirmed what Einstein predicted, who we'll hear from in just a minute. We are very familiar with a medium being affected by objects in it, such as these ducks on the pond causing ripples and the drops of water doing the same. We also are very familiar with a beautiful balance forming when opposing forces are equal, such as these beachgoers. It is this cause and effect with nature always seeking a balance that we keep in mind as we dive into the subject of frame dragging. There are two types of frame dragging I want to introduce. The first is rotational frame dragging caused by a rotating body. The second is translational frame dragging caused by a body moving through space. So what causes frame dragging? Einstein gives us some clues with his famous equation E equal, well, here. We'll let him tell it. The equation E is equal to mc square, in which energy is part equal to mass multiplied with the square of the velocity of light, showed that very small amount of mass may be converted into a very large amount of energy, and vice versa. The mass and energy were in fact equivalent. According to the formula mentioned above. This was demonstrated by Cobra and Walton in 1932 experimentally. Mass can be thought of as a place of very high energy. Energy comes in waves or oscillations. These energy bundles distort space. This distorted space causes mass to interact with each other, causing the effect we observe and call gravity. That could mean this same effect occurs as the dense energy packet passes through space rotationally or translatorially. Space is warped in yet another way. Please let me know in the comments if you have any other explanations as to what causes this. I am pretty excited that we may be on the verge of getting to the bottom of this, which will mean really cool sciencey things will come out of it. Bonus points if you can name the made-up words used in this episode.